I grew up in a family of bluegrass musicians in uh, the Midwest, and I think probably early on I knew that I wanted to be, uh, I wanted to do something with music. My stepdad was a fiddle player, and so that's how I was really exposed to music in the beginning. He had a little bluegrass band called the Part-Time Pickers, and my parents were really big into oldies, and by oldies I mean essentially 50s and 60s music, and I think that that's probably what initially really got me hooked on pop music, is like hearing that kind of harmony and, and just, it really kind of defined the era, and like, uh, you know, I hear music now from my own era, and I want to be one of the, you know, the people who documents what, what I'm hearing now. There's no real hard and fast rules when you're writing about music or art in general. I mean, a lot of times it, it, it's very subjective and it just hits you a certain way. And but, you know, when you have to write about it and you know that there are hundreds of thousands of people reading you, it, you do take it very seriously, and you, and you want your reputation as a writer to be intact, and, and you don't want to write something that's just frivolous and and silly, and then in 20 years, <laughs> people call it up online. My name is James Reed and I'm a pop music critic for the Boston Globe and Boston.com.